While these shade plants don't need direct sunlight to survive, they do need indirect light which can come from the small windows or from fluorescent bulbs in your office. 1. The ZZ plant, Zama Colchis Zamiafolia. This virtually indestructible houseplant can take months and months of neglect and low light and still look amazing. While ZZ plants can take direct light, you may see some scalding on the leaves if it is left in direct light. Additionally, curling leaves, yellowing, and leaning can all be an indication of too much light. When you notice curling taking place, it typically means the plant is trying to move away from the light source. Move the plant to a shadier location or farther away from the light source. You can also try filtering the light with curtains or blinds if moving the plant is not feasible. 2. Madagascar Dragon Plant Madagascar Dragon Tree, also called Red Edge Dracaena, is one of the most popular houseplants around. It bears narrow green leaves banded in red or pink on top of slender stems. Its upright habit makes Madagascar Dragon Tree a useful houseplant to grow against a blank wall or to provide privacy in front of a window. When it's young, Madagascar Dragon Tree adds beautiful texture to tabletops and other surfaces. It's often included in dish gardens because of its grassy look. It's almost impossible to kill, but be sure it is not in direct sunlight, because that could damage it. 3. Agleonema Silver Queen Plant. This plant is commonly called a Chinese evergreen. The variegated foliage would make a statement in any home or office. Agleonemas are great low-light and low-water plants making them a great choice for beginners. 4. Weeping Fig Tree. All that this indoor tree needs to stand tall and fabulous is an occasional trim and routine watering. However for the most part, this is an easy-going, versatile houseplant that needs minimal attention but will still reward you with something quite appealing to look at. It also fits into many settings from traditional to modern and is a perfect way to add life to an empty corner. 5. Parlor Palm. Parlor Palm is a very attractive small palm that grows to a height of 2 to 3 meters with cane-like stems. Parlor Palm grows well in bright filtered light, like what you'd get at a window with a sheer curtain but this adaptable palm also tolerates and thrives in low light. Don't water unless the soil is dry, otherwise you might kill it. 6. Cast Iron Plant. Cast Iron Plant practically grows in the dark, making it an excellent choice for those difficult to fill areas in deep shade. It has a deep green glossy leaves and is so undemanding that it survives neglect that would easily kill lesser plants. When grown outdoors, it produces creamy purple flowers near the base of the plant, but the blossoms usually do not appear with indoor plants. 7. Monsteras. Monsteras appreciate a warm, humid environment, a good amount of water and gentle sunlight. Place your monstera where it can receive medium to bright indirect light. While it is tolerant of lower light conditions, you may notice leggy growth as a result, so a spot where it will receive bright indirect light is ideal. Monsteras are climbing plants and love to ascend vertical surfaces. If you want to grow your monstera tall instead of wide, Use stakes or moss sticks to guide its growth upward. 8. Umbrella Palm. Umbrella houseplants will need moist, warm conditions such as those around an indoor pond. It thrives best in shady, boggy spots, so try placing its pot over a tray of water so it can have a constantly moist substrate. 9. Snake Plant. The snake plant, commonly referred to as mother-in-law's tongue, is a resilient succulent that can grow anywhere between 6 inches to several feet. Not only does it need watering just once a month, but it can also go weeks with neglect while still standing tall and firm. Partial sun works best for snake plants. Though, it can still grow in darker corners or in brighter window areas. If completely shaded, the plant can dull and the leaves may become a bit floppy. 10. Sword Fern. The sword fern is a beautiful, full plant that's perfect for adding luscious green to your home. Since ferns are native to the tropics and naturally grow in high humidity, a hanging sword fern is a perfect addition to your bathroom. The evaporating water will provide humidity ferns crave. If you have a humidifier, place the plant near the humidifier or in the room with the humidifier.